Hello comrades, we are back on track right we left off and we preparing for the grand finale. So let's go! So today we are cleaning some things up and starting new projects and look where we land for the grand finale in 1963. So, what's important for me is how is the situation in the university. We have some students but not so many. Mm. would like to have some more. Um, what I've said la last time is the university has a limited reach which is by design. But maybe we increase temporary the reach so everyone can enjoy high education. Yep. Radio station will suck a lot of people out and next thing is well what do you do? Next thing is can we make something half decent, please? Thank you. Interrupting me, stupid game. Um, the next thing is with the radio, we need a lot of people, and also um, my professors are dying off, which is a bad thing. Yeah, we don't like this. Do you have a mechan? Yeah, you have spot for mechanization, so you don't need people. This one was off a long time. Let's gravel up some roads to make our city a little bit more civilized. Um, these flats don't need the road access. But if they have one, it's good. Because there are some public services who want to enter here. Like... Hospitals, strict police, normal police, yeah. They all want to have a look -sees. Mm. So I give them one. the town a little bit more finished this way. Okay. Good. Somebody's still without a ticket. You. Get one. Let's assign some people to the shorter arts. Okay. This should be managed by mechanization. Good. Okay. Little improvements, but I want to get this one on the road uh, before we proceed. I also want to get get a little bit rid of this mud situation here. And uh, let's build another mud office here. <laughs> yeah. Mud office we come. Mm, this mud office. 
is tasked with them and they will help building me the bridge. Get some serious workforce in there. Also get their own world crane. We all love our road crane. At the moment, the bridge is occupied by this crane and the small people of his. Mm. Um, yeah. Get a little upgrade. Ooh, road is done. Okay. Road is done and we make some upgrades to this one. Will be a road building episode here. Thank you. And we built by this office. So you you are still in base. Could you help with the road? Maybe, please. Yeah. Hopefully. Okay. So here in our, our oil business land, uh, not much was happening all time. This will change now. Mm, we build a little bus station. Bussy, bussy, bus here. Okay. Let's build it like so, maybe. Mm. So, and so, mm. blow this one up, okay, let's tell everyone from here to work on there, and these are the people, I think, hopefully. Mm, no, they aren't. Hmm. What are you? You are Dumpers. Okay. And the other ones are the rest. Okay. So let's hope this one does what I want them to do. Okay. What do you have here? Um, so people currently unemployed. Yeah, for the bus stop, okay. The dumpers are on the way. Here we have two waiting in the off in doing nothing. Okay. Can we have another one of these three ones? So our mini crew here gets some action. Yeah, like you. Sorry for the scrolling. Go here. Good, good. And uh, we started to build the... Uh, we started here with the refueling facility. <laughs> Where is the facility? Here's the facility. Yeah. We succeeded, which is nice. So we need another of these fine facilities. Just because um, vehicles who get stranded are a little bit stupid.
right here. Okay. And I need Mr. Cons Mr. Distribution. Where is Mr. Distribution of the fuel? You. Okay. And back we go. Okay. Good. So this should be covered some way. Mm. Here we move uh, the small people office out. And the large people office in. Source of workers is this one. Yeah. Please do nothing automatically. Okay. Good. Looks busy here. Only one is the side. I suspect two were assigned. Ah, maybe you are... Yeah. You are not responsible for the roads at the moment. Uh, make you responsible for the roads. So all your excavators can move out and do something for me. If you feel like it. Comrade. Okay. Let's hope for the best. Good, good, good. Oh, here the university has some additional footpath, I think. Let's see, here and there. Okay. Have you reached some new buildings? This one we are reaching now. Okay. Only one building one. So this one is too far. Oh well. This can go. Cleaning up. Are you ugly? Ah. On the verge of. Hmm. Some uh, dangerous beautification. <laughs> what should we do? Plant a little bit of foliage. If it's too much, I will remove it afterwards. The city looks a little bit barren. It's the current state. Okay. All the monuments do not help. <laughs> Good. What we want here is also um, to get out of the mud business. We need some distribution. So let's build a regular distribution office here. Totally new, I know, I know. But yeah, what will you do? It can be built here. Do we want it here? Mm. I think we do. Kind of angular to the whole business here. It looks a little bit. <laughs> Wrong order, I think. Now that I have sent all the excavators away. Oh, nice. Uh, now this one I don't want. Let's see. If this helps, anyway. No. Hmm. 
Mm. Now I'm getting picky, you know. <laughs> Flanking everything in like no tomorrow and now at the end. Mm. So let's repair this one. So it's a nice slope again. Okay. And just to remind you, the whole city was built on a hill. It was not a flat terrain. Just a little bit of preparation. We made it work. So... More trees. Here was some forest and we get back to forest. Reforestation. Okay. This one out. This one out. Good, good. Okay. Another one is the technical services. We can get out of the mud business. Maintenance. A nice technical service. Where do we place you? I'd like you somewhere like here, in the center. Somehow fitting with the whole situation here. Your fuel station. Hmm. What about here? How oh, is it away? No. But here you go. Oh, it's the. Uh, Get a small call back to the piping situation. Let's try. No. No. Because we're digging out the heat pipe. No. <laughs> Come on. Hostile pipes. There's something like... I want to go in here. You know? Have you seen it? I have seen it. Yeah. Yes? No? No? <laughs> Oh, and now near? No. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I don't like me. So come on. Yeah. Was a little bit persistent. Okay. Good, good. So this will be the main technical service for all our snowplows here. Like I said, cleaning a little bit up. Making us pretty for the big finale. <laughs> okay, good. Uh, we are pumping out the stuff as fast as we can here. Hopefully. Yeah, should be because the input is, uh, storage is empty. Okay, okay. Oh, last stage. 178 work days. Okay. Let's see if something is happening here. Okay. Yep. He does his thing. They have fuel. Nice, nice. So do we have any free dis 
construction offices. Main thing why, apart from you can place them at once, is um, the free ones don't burn. <laughs> the ones you build can burn. What should help if and when they burn is uh, if they have power or not. There's something written in the logs, but I cannot build one. Because I need them. Yeah. When Mr. Bulldozer here is finished. Four days. Three. Two. One. Go. Okay. When Mr. Bulldozer here is finished. But I want... Um, yeah. I have two here. Mr. Bulldozer can maybe go... Here? Is it? A yeah, it is. Okay. What oh, I can auto-search. Will not hurt. Okay. Hello. Um, so this one is free. Okay. So I can place you... Wait a minute. Come back! So I can place you here. Oh, no bulldozer. Oi, oi, oi. No bueno. Okay. Good. On we go. Our little project. So... This city gets its radio station like it must. Where do you hide? Culture. Yep. Hunking big thing. Uh -oh. Where does this monster look somewhere decent? Answer is nowhere. Should we park you in here? Like so. Can do. Okay. I always, if uh, I make room for this one, I always wiggle a little bit around. So you, uh, we have an easier time to build some roads afterwards. I have a road for the construction. And... I need a footpath connection here. Oh, that's not how I imagined it. Okay. You want to go like so. So we go like this. And that. And... Is it... Okay. Okay. Meeting with the red stars. Going. Oh no. Let's see. Okay. 
Okay. Good. Because they need some access to the educated part of our town. Oh no. Like here and like here. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Don't like it if they are half built like this one. So you don't get built. Hmm. Have a good connection to the crime and justice. Somewhere, anywhere. Okay. Good. Like this, like so. Okay. Yep, they are on it. So, the ground stage. 3000 work days. 300, 200 tons of concrete. Go fast, please. Everything here is finished. You need people. You get some. Okay. Looks good. Oh, you can have a mechanization. <laughs> good for you. You also. Okay. Good, good. Oh, still a leftover here. Funny enough, these substations didn't burn to this day. <laughs> well, something should change in this game, but uh, usually the substations don't burn. The uh, Bigger ones burn. Okay. Good. You are not connected properly by our standards. No. Yes. Yes. No. Yes. Maybe so. Really more like a completionist move, like <laughs> it should be really important, but yeah. Okay. Here we go. So uh, how is our situation with uh, highly educated people? Mm. We have now 110 and you see, yeah, we're getting new ones and it was on the uh, decline. There was a sharp decline, this one was the heating situation, and after that, um, some were dead, some are dying, so, yeah, better keep an eye on it. It's interesting that nobody come here, because maybe nobody can come here. That's possible. Oh, good. This one is going on. This one also. Not ah, groundwork stage. Does it make it a priority so they finish it? Maybe also some people. So, you? Not finished. Ah. Your fair share of asphalt, please. Oh, maybe it's the last load. Planted by our people because we have no mechanizations. 
How much do you have? Two tons. Yeah. Should be. Should be fine. Thank you, people. Okay. So we have a um, connected situation from nearly one border to border here. Yeah. Here's the border here. And we can go from here over the bridge to this road. To that road. To that road. To Canada. <laughs> You're welcome. Um, and this is the western border. Um, I started this road projects uh, at a stage where I simply didn't care about my um, road crew here. So they had nothing to do. They could finish it and they were fine with it. And that's all. And that's very important. Because um, if you build roads when you don't need them in the starting stage, you will get nowhere. <laughs> it's a little bit of a problem. Um, just because you block your border, you block your people and you block everything. Uh, with projects you don't need and want and whatever. So one of the key factors is if you want to be fast and the starting phase of realistic mode and in the later stages also is don't build no shit <laughs> and simple as that um, don't build nothing you don't need always ask yourself do you need or do i need really this thing <laughs> if the answer is probably no don't build it and uh, this is why i started with basically two roads so one road from here to the um, harbor so I can start building the harbor because the harbor was one of the slowest things. And the other road was from the other border to the oil field. So I will make some money and not get bankrupt. Which is a nice goal to have in life. Yeah. And not bankrupt we are. So uh, I can nearly kill the whole loan. Let's take a look. Seven hundred twenty-four. Yeah. So one ship load and it's gone. <laughs> but uh, this one is a big project, so um, it really will take some four hundred tons of steel. How much does a ton of steel cost and weigh us down? Mm, steel, steel, steel. Five hundred uh, rubles. So it's uh, um, 10 tons are 5,000 rubles, 100 tons are 50,000 rubles times 400 uh, times 4. That's so it's 200,000 rubles just in steel for this one. Yeah, it's a big expense. And I said it before, I don't think it's the most important thing for such a small city. I think we have our loyalty in check with uh, passive loyalty. We can take a look. So, uh, my favorite overlays, and have this one, it should be... Yeah. So, this is the loyalty situation. Uh, that we don't know. Why we don't know our loyalty situation, comrades? Well, nobody wants to work here. Kudos to you, but hey. Interesting. My people have some taste. Somebody should come to work here. Nobody wants. Ah, uh, do you need... Do you need highly educated ones? Mm -hmm. Let's see. Could be the case. These ones are only... Smart guys. Could use a little bit of fuel, but I'm also building this one here. Yeah. Waiting for gravel. Okay. Okay, so the road is done, and with that, our ships cannot cross to the <laughs> rest of the lake. I have showed it before, but I find it very uh, excellent of the game that they introduce 
uh, to the measuring tool a function where you can see uh, what your bridge does. Hopefully you can see. Or you can see it in a construction phase. <laughs> no, here. You see uh, how high the bridge is and it's not very high, but it's it was deliberate. I don't want it to build a, a very big hill here. So I made a kind of a little bit of crappy bridge, but um, we only need to uh, the access to the border. If I would have a long longer playthrough, I would uh, have a raised bridge so the ships can pass. How big the ships are is displayed here. So he has a height of 17 meters, bridge is 10 meters. Uh, would be not so pleasant <laughs> if he tries to go under it. Yeah. Okay. This one is done. Mm, because now I can use this border post for some shenanigans here. I want to do something a little bit of. Yeah. So we start to develop our oil field and <laughs> now and behold a normal fire station it is <laughs> yeah um, because we need some stuff uh, which requires fire coverage You go. You need everything. You get everything. From the locals. Okay. Good. Fire coverage. We need uh, electricity. These things can burn and the, subst uh, the bigger ones can burn. Um, I think I've seen them burn both. Let's hope they will not go it in flames. The absolute start. Okay. Good. So this is the start. And next thing we need is another big project. Just the oil refinery. The oil refinery uh, produces yeah, it needs 250 tons of oil and produces 125 tons of fuel and uh, 75 tons of bitumen um, oh. Uh oh I see a problem no oh, I see no problem it will be run by foreign workers Again, a longer playthrough. Oh god. Do you want to be placed somewhere? No, you don't want to be placed somewhere. Um, yeah, excavator is missing. Hmm. Okay. We will return. <laughs> Must return. Where are you two linger along? You. I need you. Oh my god. He's refueling. Okay. You do you. How do we look here? Uh, 
Okay. All the excavators are busy. So only uh, dumpers are now in play. Okay, we're on the next stage. Waiting for stuff. Stuff should be delivered. Yep. Nice. Okay. What does the city do? Do we have now... Yeah, they need smart people. Oh, you bugger. Need more smart people. Hmm. Police didn't come. Oh, police has something to do. It still hurts a little bit that we have uh, very little educated people. Get a little bit more of them. The courthouse is doing fine. If you look for crime rates, uh, look at your house and uh, look here, 1%, which is always 1%. Um, if you are fired at 1%, you should do something. Um, and if you have above 7%, you should immediately do something. And if you have over, let's like, say, 15%, you are in really big trouble. Crime is pushing down your happiness of your people. If you push down the happiness of the people, they are less productive. My God, do we have many of them? Um, they are less productive, so they will solve your crime slower. Ninety percent happiness, we go. <laughs> like predicted. Um, yeah, ticking along, which is nice. Okay, you are done. So we should move you, Lord. Yeah, you get a new home. You go here. Hopefully you arrive here. <laughs> so, so, so. Okay. Oh, you need people and you have people. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I can excavate. So let me please. <laughs> No? You bugger! What's your plan now? No, no, no. Yes? Okay. <laughs> Let's be friends here. After that, you can do whatever you want. At the moment, you are mine. Okay. Like this. Like that. Good. So the oil field is around the lake. Let's see. We can start laying out the uh, automated oil field like you are used to <laughs> with pumps and all that jazz. Um, but not at the moment. Uh, at the moment, first step is getting a refinery to work. 
second step will be um, automate all in. Yeah. So to get the refinery work, we can need, or we should need a tank. Will come in handy. You are out here. Can we mirror you maybe like so? Mm, don't like it. But we can do something like this. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You can go back to your auto search endeavors. Yeah. And let's assign everything to everyone. You're still assigned? Yeah. Let's hope so. Okay. So, fire station, electricity, this and that. Uh, here can be a pump, um, which means that this one will be filled but not pumped into the, into the oil refinery, but I'm okay with that. Um, this is the external storage for the oil field and it's enough. If you have a pump, it will first fill up the internal storage of the um, refinery. But it's not needed here. Okay. So, uh, if my buses are here. Well, my buses. Yep. Another free office for me. Okay. Lot of gravel and lot of concrete. So nobody will be here shortly free. Which is a shame. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Let's put them on uh, normal priority. So maybe they will start with a footwork business. Okay. Good, good. So we hopping back. Ah, yeah, the buses. Oh, hello. <laughs> How do you do? Yeah, good on fuel. Yeah, have a nice cross country road. Right. <laughs> okay. Actually, with the buses, we can make some shenanigans. Where are you? Here. Change of plan, my friend. You go here. And you go here. Load me workers. And unload them here. Okay. And you don't go to the depot. Let's hope I find your friends. You are mine? Yeah. Okay. Go to the line. Good. Um... I think your friends are still on the way to the depot. Yeah. You go here. And you go here. They will turn around at the end of the road because they cannot do otherwise. Have line spacing. Um.
Okay, here we need for the ground stage some concrete mixers. Total capacity. Uh, what? I think I'm totally wrong. Uh, concrete mixer. Yeah. Oh. And uh, dumpers we have on the backside, I think, enough. So let's go here with mm, open holes. Yep. Total capacity. All the little sweet mods. <laughs> and guess what? Yep. Okay. Good. So, you get everything from here. And you get everything from here. Maybe auto search 3000 meters. I don't know what you will find, but let's see. Maybe they found something. Maybe don't. Uh, I don't w didn't want to touch my foreign workers in the other border post because I don't know exactly how they react if I because I was long time reliant on this border post and the foreign workers here um, to keep my business running and have uh, fire protection. And uh, heat and so, such. So, yeah. Okie dokie. So, uh, as I said, I will convert fuel to oil. Uh, no, oil to fuel. <laughs> and it's a ratio like, I don't know, let's say one to one. So, um, for sake of ease. And two thirds fuel one third bitumen around no yeah i think so so two parts fuel one part bitumen i will produce the um, oil exports for good price but not excellent so oil exports here for 30 let's make it a little bit different let's go here make it all so you can see the graph uh, how it's developed because it's I think uh, we hurt the price a little bit by our export uh, stuff here we are yeah you see the price is <laughs> not good <laughs> this is the influence of constant exports um, I will talk uh, I will talk at the last episode with the, what the price did um, and oil, we now have um, 30 rubles per ton. And if we look at um, fuel and bitumen, it's on the first page, I think. So, uh, fuel. Uh, it looks like it's just connected to the price of oil. So, fuel is 112, which is three times as much, maybe four times. And bitumen is <laughs> here 182 so it's uh, six times as much as fuel and um, this is why I built the road to Canada because I took some loans in the uh, dollars business and the Yankees want their dollars back <laughs> imagine that <laughs> so um, I make uh, I make my product uh, higher higher value product with foreign workers like Qatar and um, be happy to export them to the Yankees. Yep. You go on high priority. Okay. This is why I built this contraption and uh, do something for my foreign workforce because they are sitting there at the border having nothing to do being very sad. Um, the oil field was neglected a long time. So we can make a little bit more money with them. Um, oh, good. They, f they found everything, but have nothing to do. That's okay. They will come into play. Okay. Good, good. Oh, we have here our distribution business. So let's change you. You go here. Uh, 
and you get the border. You loaded the border. Oh, no, no. Where I am. This, this. Food? Uh, no. This? No? Yes? Did I forget something? Uh, chemicals, yes. Okay. And you go in here to unload me some chemicals. I do want a second uh, truck, actually, of this priority. V3 has covered. Yeah? was not the biggest uh, truck because it didn't need to here we are our little army truck okay and a second oil truck also for good measure yeah one big ones but not modded ones okay good So, going here refueling, you going here for the small stuff, this and that, you going here for the meat stuff, going here for the drinking stuff, going here to fuel, 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 UIF, okay, okay. We have no foot here. Oh, ooh, mm. this is a problem. <laughs> yeah, but they're not escaping. Hmm, interesting. Didn't know about that. So no food and you okay, buddy? Most likely not so much. Yeah, because they get meat. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Interesting. But if they come out, uh, I think they will be no happy buggers. So, yeah. I thought they would run away. Uh, no. No food here. Um... This is the small storage, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Good, 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 good. Um, yeah. Because I didn't want to import food here by a distribution office, you are responsible for the food business. Okay. Good that we fixed it. Who would thought about that? Let's hunt some more things to fix. Mm. Where is the... Muddy... Okay. Good. Yep. Yep. Most likely I've overseen one. But I will replace the uh, fuel stations. Yeah. Um, with normal fuel stations. Okay. What can you do? Ah, yeah. Can pull out some stuff. Okay, nice. Sadly, he cannot refuel himself. Good. Yeah, they are on the move. Again, out of material. I think the dumpers have... Oh, yes. Okay. Yeah, now we're talking. Now they're eating all of my people. This limit is to 50. I don't want to have a collapsing situation here. But yes, here's also good. So, um... 
Again, no one. Not good, but acceptable. Do we lose a lot of academics, maybe? Like I said, the, the time for dying off starts now. 130 feet. Okay, we are on the rise, but not in the way I want them to be. Let's go hunting for some. Maybe we can find them. Yes. Get a little move. Okay. One. Uh, mm -mm. Zero. Seven. So twofold. If I tell them where to work, I can be more precise. At the same time, it is possible that uh, they say, oh, I have nothing to work. And please don't move in here. Um, 102. They are hiding from me. It's possible that uh, these are also... They are highly educated, but not in the working age. Okay. Maybe we built a freaking dorm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So... Because secret police is offline. They don't will us... They don't will tell us our secrets. Their secrets. 90% happiness. 40% loyalty. But I want to have at least one of them here. Maybe two. The red stars. Mm. By my experience, uh, having 15% of loyalty uh, of uh, passive propaganda, like these stars provide, you will end up with 35% uh, of loyalty. And I have, uh, in addition to the stars, Comrade Lenin, which does his job, and uh, another one here, which does his job to these houses, and the third one here, which does his job to these houses. This house is very sad. <laughs> Not the best propagandized house in this city. Um, because too little loyalty will hurt you. And uh, loyalty of 40% uh, is uh, quite good. Uh, with passive loyalty will reach maximum of 45%. So the developers say. Do we... Yeah, okay. Crime is dealt with. And they have something to eat, so they should be a little bit more happy. Yeah. <laughs> Buggers. Um, yeah, 45% is the maximum loyalty you can achieve with passive loyalty, but uh, your radio station will be more effective um, because it does not need to uh, uh, um, levitate the loyalty so much. Like if you start from 20 or 30%, for example. And the uh, monuments, once they are built, they are for free. It's a nice thing. With the footpath, do you have a higher reach? Okay, I think... No. No one new has come to the fray. Okay. So it's okay. Slowly but surely we will gain people. But this one bugs me, so... By fucking places. Cause do you show me your loyalty? It will not be spectacular, don't get me wrong. <laughs> Um, cost of loyalty will be everywhere the same. Like forty percent, like the same, same here. Okay, good. With the big plans and uh, little progress, <laughs> um, I leave you. Oh, I want to go one last thing. Six hundred fifty-five. Hmm. We cannot kill the loan. Really sad. 700. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Next episode, maybe. But we have a big, big predict projects on the way, so. Uh, <laughs> will not be a super fast business. Yeah. Yeah, they also started. 
first buildings are up, this will can burn. <laughs> but it should not burn because it has no electricity. Not so likely burn. But you know the game. Okay. With this one, I leave you to... Uh, <laughs> to... I don't know what. <laughs> I just say bye-bye, guys. <laughs> uh, and see you next time. Bye. <laughs>